there are few, literally few things in life mm. that can cause me to not think about proper rest, hydration, or eating. And one of them, the top, is focusing on the work of actors and acting. Mm. Like writing about it, watching it, critiquing it, thinking about it. I just lose my freaking mind. What about pooping? I love that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, welcome back to our Stupid Directions Unit. I'm Corbin. Good. This is Rick. Good. And you can follow us on Big Instagram, movement. Twitter for Good juicy content. Thanks for Patreon. Yeah, Should count the results for each one. Follow us on personal YouTube channels. Links in the description below. Today we're doing a trailer reaction. Great. It is called Bandit Queen. Bandit. Bandit Queen. Something on a tangerine. Tangerine? Yeah, why not? Uh, with Seema Biswas and Shakir Kapoor. Bandit Queen. <laughs> Bandit Queen is a 1994 Indian biographical film based on the life of Poolin Devi, as covered in the book India's Bandit Queen. The true story of Poolin Devi by the Indian author Malasen. The film won National Film Award for Best Feature Film in Hindi. The film stars Seema Biswas, who is an Indian film and theater actress from Assam. And she won the National Film Award for Best Actress for this film and became famous. She has acted in various Hindi, Assamese, Bengali, Marathi, Tamil, and Malayalam films. The director of this movie, Shakir Kapoor, is known for his works in Hindi cinema and international cinema. Films like Mr. India Bandit Queen, Masoon, made him famous in Hindi cinema. In international cinema, his historical biopics on Queen Elizabeth, Elizabeth, and Elizabeth, the Golden Age have earned him acclaim with the former winning the BAFTA Award for Outstanding British Film and both winning an Academy Award. Elizabeth, like, uh, with Catherine, uh, with, with, with Kate Blanchett? I don't know, but I believe Nasser didn't win a BAFTA for a film called Elizabeth. No, he may have been in. That would be crazy if, if it's the same. Him? I'd never seen if it. If it's the same one with, uh... The, from 1998? With Kate Blanchett. By the way, if you haven't seen the work of Kate Blanchett, Ooh. You need to watch the work of, she's one of the greatest actresses Actress alive. Ever. She's ever. up there with Meryl Streep. She is. She she's is. up there in the top five all time female actresses oh, in cinema. So good. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, also, I was, I was going through all the films that we've watched, and I, I realized that we need to watch more films with really strong women. women. In the leads, yes. Um, so they just need to be made. Yeah, um, and I'm sure they are, but we just haven't got to them yet. Maybe. Um, so please recommend some down below. Is this one taboo? Uh, because we actually have seen a lot, but it's in uh, OTT. Correct. Where we've seen a lot, a lot more women roles and strong women roles in the in the TV shows. Um, so recommend some, please. If this is it, let us know. And so this is old, so I'm guessing the trailers might be bad. Who knows? All right. Uh, let me make sure my speakers are on. Bandit Queen! Ooh. <laughs> Evergreen Entertainment presents a powerful and extraordinary film. Yes. That the New York Post gives four stars. Astounding and overpowering, says the Daily News. Dramatic, with superb performances, says the London Guardian. While the Hollywood Reporter calls it a mesmerizing picture. Bandit Queen. <laughs>
Rani, because Rani is queen. That opinion. was one of the best old trailers we've yeah, ever seen. That was really good. It, should, it looks like what I was talking about, a strong female driven film uh, that a woman oppressed by men is just also called women uh, yeah. in, in general. But uh, that looks really, really good. I, it really I would, does. I would totally watch that film. I would totally watch uh, that film too. It, it, the main girl, when she had the bandana on her head, reminded me of, what was yes. that Sushant film? Yes, with, exactly. With him and Monos, right? Yes. And they met this girl yes. who also had a bandana around her head. Who was, is it, was that Queen like, of the Gangsters. Is that who she was playing or was that supposed to be inspired by? This girl, is that just how they dress? I don't know. I don't know, but that's what it reminded me of, right? Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, that's the first thing that came to my mind when, she, when I saw that on her head. This looks like a powerful film. Yeah. Looks, looks like, like it's having... going to be one of those that's probably going to be a little hard to watch as well. Um, yeah, unquestionably, one of the better old school trailers we've even ever seen. Even with the uh, talking. Yeah, even with the talking. I just There's something so great about the narration stuff, because that used to be the thing back in the day. So 1994. There was also Bandit Queen in 1950. And it's back, that's back in the day when, you know, whenever a movie came out, back when newspapers were the source for your information, not the internet, you would check the entertainment section of the newspaper on a Friday for the new releases. And if a movie was critically acclaimed, if a, Yes. It is that one. It is that Elizabeth. Uh, if a movie was critically acclaimed in the newspaper, you would see the snippets that they were talking about from the Hollywood Port Reporter, the New York Post, Variety. But it was only those things that were definitively critically acclaimed that got that. Nowadays, you can literally pay people yeah. to say nice things about your film yeah. or take a snippet from like the Council Bluffs Herald. Mesmerizing! And then down at the bottom, you can't even read it, says the Council Bluffs Herald. Uh, so this was back in the day when those kinds of accolades actually meant a lot more than they do today. So he is, this is the same director who directed that Elizabeth film yes. with Kate Blanchett. Yes. Nawaz, uh, not Nawaz, Nasseruddin Shaw in that? No. Okay. Well done. Um. Uh, how do you spell his name? Who? Nasseruddin. Oh. It's a long one. N A S E R should be there, or you know what? Just look up. Um, oh, hold on. Got him. There he is. Um, because I'm pretty. Maybe I'm off on the name, but I'm pretty sure he's won a BAFTA uh, awards in Dubai Film Fair. Riveting content, I know, guys. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, maybe, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, or it's not on here. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, it's the Kate Blanchett one. So it's that director for this uh, for this film. Um, so, uh, like I said, we would like to watch some. I know there's also. Um, I think Taboo. I think she plays like a exotic dancer. In, in some film earlier in her career uh, as well. I think it's called Something Bar or something like that. Um, but I'm talking like strong female performances as oh. well. I asked, and you know, we love Taboo. Yep. Uh, <laughs> uh, is she the best actress in India that you've seen so far? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Was well, she going to get her OTT platform or does she have one? Yeah, she would be for me, of the people we've seen, she'd be for me the, like the Meryl Streep of... Indian cinema yeah, is taboo. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so let us know about this film. Is it uh, worth a watch? Uh, I probably is. It looks good. Looks good to me. Um, hold on, how long is it? Let's see. If it came out in the 90s, it, it, oh, geez. What? Two hours. Barely a two hour runtime? Jeez. I was expecting three hours. <laughs> That might be why so many people liked it from America. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> uh, so yeah, let us know uh, if this is something we should accept. And obviously, it's a true story. Where do you see that? But it's the story of the Bandit Queen, Pulan Devi. Oh, okay. All and the more reason to want to see it. It and also let us know if it's that same person that was kind of like, yeah, in that Sushant film. I, it starts with an S. I can't ever pronounce the name. The, of you it. know which one we're talking about. If you've been around, <clears throat> Sushant. 
uh, with uh, Manoj, Manoj, and uh, they met this girl who's protecting this younger girl. That one that we really enjoyed. Yeah, really very, good very good film. Anyways, let us know about this film down below. Look <laughs> <laughs>